first since 1969. Chris Nixon showing his athleticism, fumbles the football, and it looks like the Wolverines have it at the 33-yard line. By Michigan against Vanderbilt. Nixon in trouble, and sacked back at the 8-yard line. Vanderbilt with an empty backfield, and Nixon after he faked the handoff to Jackson, swung down again by Woodley. Third and 25, just trying to get a little room for the punter, and they don't do that. 2.20 to go, the clock running on the change of possession, a new rule this year, and a sack again for Lamar Woodley. Third down and one, and Jackson Garrison doesn't get there. Rondell Biggs, and from their own 13-yard line, trailing 13-7, to seven. Nixon try to draw, and Michigan was not fooled. Up his total on the last play. Jason Jackson Garrison has rushed five times for minus three. There. Jared Hawkins, the running back in the game. Nixon. Well, to me, Chris, that one's on him. Under 11 minutes to go. Michigan leads 20 to 7. Nixon hangs on again way too long. Again. Four receivers and Hawkins, the running back. A low snap handled by Nixon. Nobody open. Has to throw it up. Just heaves it toward the corner of the end zone. Incomplete. Brundage, Alabama, a town of only about 2,300. He was valedictorian of his high school class at Pike County. Gave it to Kaysen Jackson. A lot of time with under five minutes to go and down by 13. Where it hurts to have an inexperienced quarterback. Where it helps to have a great athlete at quarterback. Nixon fumbles again. And the Wolverines have it. Ohio State and Austin. You'll see that Virginia Tech team here on ESPN at noon next Saturday against North Carolina.